Hi Aquarius, welcome. Let's jump right in here and see what's going on with who you're dealing with. What are their true thoughts and feelings and intentions towards you? Now keep in mind Aquarius, this is a general reading so it's not going to resonate with all of you. But for more readings after this, please go ahead and check out my husband's tarot channel at Possessed 777 and I do offer same day personal readings. Uh, everything you need to know is in the description box below. Thank you Aquarius. Ooh, Aquarius. Okay, so what is going on here, Aquarius, with who this is you're dealing with, what they're saying is you make them depressed as fuck. That's what they're saying. I'm not saying it's real or true. What they're saying is you depress the hell out of them because they are so, they just, oh my God, just the emotions. It's just, let's just not even dwell on it. They're dwelling. There's a lot of grudges and dwelling and sadness and depression. There's so much pain they're going through that they're not wanting to let go of and heal and release from this about them and you. And then what they're saying is it's because of you, you caused it. I don't know if it's true or not. You can decide. But right after this, they've lost all hope and faith with you. They're not willing to be faithful to you and or trustworthy. They don't believe in you or themselves or any of this is going on. And they've gone cold, maybe a little narcissistic too. Right after this, okay, they want to just move forward and just drop it. Just move forward with you and just try. But they want to move forward by not doing absolutely anything. As in, they, um, they're greedy, okay? Um, they don't want to work, <laughs> be stable, okay? They don't want anything long-term. They just want you to do it all, okay? They're financially dependent on you. They don't want to do shit, okay? Right after that. So because they're depressed, because there's no hope, no faith, and because they don't want to work and do anything here with you, they're basically like, and I'm going to cheat then. Unfortunately for some of you, they're cheating on you. Or this is just someone that's like, I'm just going to drink, pop pills, smoke, and just go back to my vices, and I don't even care. Or this is a really shitty friend, okay? And there's gossiping, there's bullshit, there's drama, there's all sorts of things. Regardless of who this is, they're not genuinely happy with you. They're not feeling celebrated. It's all fake, even if it is a little smile here and there. It's just they're not having it, okay? Right after that, they are stressed the fuck out being with you, okay? And dealing with you and doing what they're doing to you. That's why there's no passion there at all they don't want to do anything they don't even want, like if they do they want to force like a very negative chapter with you if not they don't want to do anything here with you then right after that they're hanging on to everything of monetary financial you know uh material whatever that they've built and created here with you and towards you now they're budgeting and saving and building and creating and trying to figure some things out with that so there's that at least
Mm -hmm. Okay, well, Aquarius, they're well aware that they're doing all of this to you, okay? So maybe it's the continuation of them just sabotaging everything because they don't give a shit. I don't know. Because them hanging on and trying to get their hands dirty and budget and build and save and create and do something with money, I don't know, with you and helping out, this is where they get aggressive. They're clouded. They're frustrated. They're irritated. They could be verbally attacking you. I'm sorry if they are getting aggressive. And then intuitively, they know all of this. So they still choose to be committed to you with whatever kind of dynamic this is. Maybe it's contracted, whatever. I don't know. I don't care. They also go to people of information, of, you know, guidance to figure out what to do for the sake of progression here with you. Okay, cool. Things are speeding up and then boom, they don't want to do shit. They're back to irritated, impatient, frustrated, but not willing to wait and be patient and plan here with you. They don't want to resolve the conflict here with you and they feel like they're missing out in life. Then out of the blue here, there's something about the past, nostalgia, happiness, okay, maybe a little bit of healing, childhood, hopefully, let's cross our fingers. Um, you know, them having fun here with you, okay, and then right after that, they don't want to do shit again. It's back to they don't want to work on themselves, they don't want to reflect and help out and resolve any issues going on. So this is someone that either is a recluse and stays in all day long and they don't really do anything. They don't work on themselves. They're an escapist or they do it outwards like hang out with friends or go here or go there. They can never be alone. This person has issues being alone. Right after that, they stall everything with you and they're well aware. They're not even frustrated. They're totally cool with it. As in no money, no finances, approaching you, doing anything, they stall it. Everything slowed down. Jesus. Okay, well, them knowing what they're doing to you, they're confident, they're passionate, they're happy, they're planning, they're willing to get up and do something, and then obsess over getting information about you to manipulate you. They're basically manipulative, strategic, they are spying, lurking, creeping, stalking about you. They're happy about that, they're content doing that, and guess what they're leaving this reading as? They're going to be fucked up towards you, literally. They love being deceptive, lying, cheating, stealing. And doing, they're doing all three, by the way. They're lying to you, they're cheating on you, and cheating you, and they're taking from you. So, you could be dealing with um, a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Thank you, bye.